Hello dear viewers, Assalamualaikum. I am Engineer Muhammad Reza Ulhaq. Welcome to my Automation Tools YouTube channel. Today, I will show how to upload and download a program from Cimatic Multi-Panel MP27710 inch Touch HMI. So, let's start. First, we connect the Combination cable, the Ethernet cable between the SMI and the laptop. You see, I am connecting the SMI cable, sorry, the Ethernet cable between SMI and the laptop. After connecting, we go to the SMI, is a power off and power on because to connect with the laptop, we have to see the IP address of this SMI. So, we power on the SMI. For power on, we go to the control module, control panel. You see, SMI is power upping. After power off, we go to the control panel. Control panel go to the transfer. That's why here you can see the ethernet and go to the advanced uh, here you can see the ip address of this uh, combination cable or combination of ip address this ip address we have to be used for communicating between the laptop and the smi so closing closing all this phase we press in the transfer mode without of pressing transfer mode we cannot connect this laptop after pressing this we go to the open the schematic process software in this software we select our the desired model number that we want to upload this project from this SMI so our model number is MP27710 inch task so we find it and select this is the combination cable select combination cable is same ethernet because we We want to upload this project, so select the desired folder where we want to store this in our upload project. So we select the desired folder. Here we can uh, we can also insert a new folder and rename the machine name that we can uh, easily identify the same project. So we create a new folder and uh, put the name of this folder and uh, press the file name to press it upload program you can put it as your design name and press the open button and press the start backup because you press start backup you see it is a uh, trying to communicate with the SMI but it is failed so we have to check the IP address of SMI and the series IP address of this laptop. So we go to the Ethernet and go to the change adapter. Before we see the IP address series is a 192, 168, 1 and 5. So it is one series. So it is no problem. We select change the IP and press the OK and go to the schematic process software closing all go to schematic process software and here is set the combination is ethernet and here you set the ip address of smi it is the same 192 1 and 5 so select 5 Feature 5 and go to the backup option and press the start button with backup. You see, it is communicating, connection is completed or established, and the program is uploading. It is uploading step by step, it takes some time because the firmware the project and the uh, program all will be backup 
you, the right corner is showing the condition of SMI that is showing the transferring mode. That this program is transferring. You see, uploading the program. In this way, you can easily upload the program from the MP schematic multi panel MP2. 277 10 inch task SMI model SMI. You can easily done this program before you connecting with the SMI. You must be mind that the it have to be put in the SMI in transfer mode. Without transfer mode, it cannot be communicate. And you also uh, set the IP address in the schematic process software as same as the uh, ASMI IP address M the, and the laptop IP series must be same series. That means say 192, 168, 0 or something or 1 or something. If ASMI is, uh, IP series is 1, you have to be must be set in the uh, laptop or PC IP address be 1 series. That means 192, 168, 1 or and something. If this can send, then it is easily communicating. You see, it is the program uploading is going on. You can understand that how can easily you can understand uh, you can upload this program from this uh, SMI. It is take some time because the all backup are this uh, all program all firmware all are um, backuping, so it takes some time. Also, I show you in the right corner side is same the program is uploading or transferring from the SMI. It is showing the transferring is completed. So, after completing this backup, now I will show how can we restore a program in the new SMI or old SMI. If you have any problem, we can send this uh, restore is again. So, again for this restoring, you can again open the schematic process software. And here you select the desired model number that you want to download this uh, restore your project. So we select the desired model number of SMI. I am selecting the so our model number is MP2 277 10 inch task. So I find it and select and set the communication cable is after go to the restore button you select the program where you store this uploaded program so i am selecting this program where i already uploaded this program so go to and select this and press open button after open button you when you uh, and you check the combination ethernet or not you set the ip address same same ip address that you want to the restore your program so our ip address was same 192 168 1 and 5 so i put this ip address and go to the restore button restore and when you start restore then the program will be restore to the SMI. It is not restored because I have uh, opened the combination cable because our machine is running. If I press the restore button, it will be restore the program easily and for for any interruption I cannot do this. You, you can easily can understand and you can restore your program in your SMI. So dear friend, if you like my video, please subscribe my channel and press the bell icon. Also like, comment and share. Thanks for watching.